Влад, Уна Вехава и Линк Таде, Американ Индианс, Лингвистика и Амперсант Ганетикали. Don't I have enough on my plate without American Indians? But how can this be? Юст, так я лайк от хис мат, сэха в классе та ласка вэр. Итс тхэланд брит гэ. So what? That was thousands of years ago. И хавэн дэ абаут в хатэк мэанс фарус я тадая. Окей, let's hear it. Sir, Vlad is on the phone for you. Hi Vlad. I hope you've got a resolution for me. Not exactly. It's more like a proposition. Okay, I'm listening. Opie, you realize we are neighbors. I don't see how you can say that. We are not neighbors. That is because he does not know your history. Thirteen thousand years ago, Russians walked across the Bering Land Bridge to Alaska. Vlad, what has that got to do with today? Well, O.B. DNA researchers found genetic markers that linked people living in southern Siberia, with the indigenous populations in North America. You're not making any sense. What happened thousands of years ago, does not make us neighbors. O.B., you're upset. You don't want to believe my people are from Siberia are kin to you Native Americans, thereby making them of Russian descent. Vlad, I'm really tired of the history lesson. What is the proposition? One thing before I get to the proposition. Okay, all right, but make it quick. You know Russia had deep roots in Alaska. In the 17th and 18th centuries, many of our workers sired children with the natives. We consider those progeny Russian. Vlad, you're getting me angry. You know the U.S. paid Russia $7.2 million for Alaska, so forget about considering the natives to be Russian citizens. O.B., you are not stupid after all. You hit upon my proposal. If you get out of our way in the Ukraine, we will not activate our plans to annex Alaska. Now I know you're insane. What makes you think you can get away with a setting foot on the U.S. without an invitation? Of course I can away with it. You have not stuck to your so-called guns on anything up to now. Poof. Out of Syria. Poof. No action on Ukraine. You are a loyal paper tiger. Vlad, you have crossed the line. Goodbye. <laughs> OB, what's the matter? Why are you so upset? Congress has been relatively quiet lately. It's not Congress. It's Putin. He called me a toilet paper tiger. Again, I'm tired of being the world's policeman. This is not what I signed up for. This sucks.